Good morning everyone, Elsie Normington here from Merkins Community Centre and here we are another Monday morning and we're now on week 15 of our closure. Well, it sure is a long time. However, this morning I want to think about the word of spring. Over the last wee while we've seen some beautiful spring days, haven't we? We've seen the sunshine, we've seen some of the flowers starting to pop up through the ground and we've got lots of things to be thankful for. So today I want to think about the word spring and I've got a little word for each letter. So to start with, spring starts with the letter S and we want to think first of all about the sunshine because the sunshine brings light to us, doesn't it? It brings warmth to us and also the sunshine causes everything to grow. So we're thankful for the sunshine. Then P stands for pretty flowers. Well, I don't know about you, but I just love all the daffodils. And here's a wee picture of all my little mini daffodils all budding and so beautiful, bringing us joy. Then thirdly, we've got R for the roses that bloom. And shortly we'll begin to see the roses start to bud and start to bloom and I was thinking about roses because they have beautiful blooms and perfumes but not only that they have thorns and that's a bit like life isn't it a bit like what life has been over the last year where we've had the blooms and we've had the thorns in our life as we've walked through this pandemic and then I well I think spring is the best season I for it's the best season because spring gives us fresh hope doesn't it it's like a new day a new season the signs of life and growth and I love the springtime and then N stands for new life and we start to see all the wee lambs um, running around the fields and of course everywhere there's the daffodils and the spring flowers and I love that sense of new life where the winter has gone new life is coming and that's true for all of us that new life is coming when we get out this pandemic and then G stands for the grass growing now last week I had the guy that comes to cut my grass I said to him my grass is starting to look like a field when are you coming to cut it so he came and cut my grass for me and that was great because again it's another sign of new life now I'm sure you've seen the guidelines from the Scottish government there was a piece in the courier on Friday and I'm just going to bring it up here on the page just to show what the route map is going to look like as we come out of the pandemic and according to these guidelines it could be the middle of May and hopefully we'll be able to start doing at least some outdoor events. So it's lovely to see you all this morning. Thank you for logging in and I hope that little acrostic of spring just puts a wee spring in your step today. Thanks for watching and just to let you know we're still thinking of you. Goodbye from Merkins.